So we all know that YouTube Shorts is amazing and it could really drive some crazy growth to your channel. Today with this tip, I want to actually help you grow your channel as fast as possible and we're going to be taking advantage of YouTube Shorts for this video. Now there are many different ways to upload YouTube Shorts on YouTube. You could either use the PC desktop or you could be using your phone. But what if I told you that there was a way that you can take and create Shorts from videos that are already uploaded on your channel. This would mean that growth would not only be easy, but also be a lot faster. So if you find value in this video, make sure to click a like on the video just to show me a little bit of love. Show some love to me, okay? Just show some love to the creator. And if you want more tips and tricks like this, make sure to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell. But let's go ahead and get straight into it. So what I will be showing you all in this video is a quick way to make YouTube shorts from existing videos on your channel just by using your phone okay it's simple it's it's very very fast and i'm going to show you how to do it right now so we're going to go and head over to our youtube app and of course our channel is here we're going to click the top right button where our channel profile picture is and then we're going to go to your channel okay so now whatever video that is on your channel that you would like to create a short for or multiple shorts for you can go and just click on the video here so we're going to go to this google sheets one right here and then of course they have ads and whatever but the feature that we are using on youtube today is called the remix feature okay so we're going to go and press the remix and now it prompts us with a whole bunch of different options we could choose okay first one being edit into a short which is of course the one that we want you can go and use the sound if you wanted to do something different with this piece of content you could cut it into segments or you could use the green screen and you know do another short reacting to this video or reacting to a clip from this video okay so of course we're going to go and edit into a short and now it prompts us with the video let's see if i can kind of pause this real quick okay so it puts up the video for us and now we can go and find the exact segment that we wish to create into a short now the cool thing about this is that not only can we make these short 15 seconds, but we can also add extra time to it. And this is easy because all we have to do is, you see the top right, we have the 15. That is the 15 seconds for the short. By simply just clicking the 15, now we finally have a 60 second short. But typically a lot of shorts that do well for me are under 15 seconds. So we're gonna go back to the 15 seconds and then you just navigate through the video. So of course we could choose our favorite spot here. Let's say we're going to go, we'll go all the way back here, okay? So say you can position it however you like and everything. So we're gonna go ahead and position it like this. We see we have 10 seconds that is in this short. Now, of course, if we want to increase this time then we just have to put that end bar all the way back here and then we're back at our 15 second short so now from here after you find and adjust how your short is going to look now we press next all right so now youtube is going to give us a few more options when it comes to creating this youtube short so we see the preview of what the youtube short would look like and at the bottom we can either apply a uh, text so we can say hey check this out you know what i'm saying so we can do a text we could do a, another voiceover if we just wanted to show the clip but walk people through in a separate voiceover and of course that'll allow you to do the voiceover through your phone or your airpods or whatever and then we could do timeline we can even add a filter to our short okay so we're going to go no filter and done so this is really helpful if you're trying to customize it a little bit more but after all that is said and done and you're good with how your short looks then we will go and click next which is at the top right uh, corner all right so now this is where you add your title and everything like this pro tip okay pro tip i want to help you guys out the best way i can and i feel that 
you don't want to create your title on your phone. The best and the most strategic way to get views on any of your videos is to do the correct amount and also the right form of SEO and you know keyword research. So I feel that the best chance for this short to blow up when it comes to keyword research and SEO is if we complete the tag, the titles and everything like that in the desktop version of YouTube. So to simply just skip over the title and all that, all we would do is make sure the visibility is on private and then we're going to upload this short to our channel. Now it's going to give us a prompt at the bottom, uploading your or uploading to your videos, okay? Then you wait a little bit, a little bit of time goes by and then here we go, we have another pop-up, uploaded to your videos. Now it's in our videos as a private video and then we can go to desktop and finish creating that video or just doing the SEO for that video. So hopefully this video was helpful. I know it was a little quick, but um, this is all that you really have to do is it's really that easy. So go and create these shorts from your long form videos. And the best part about remixes is that if somebody is really interested in that short, they can click a link at the bottom and it drives that viewer straight to your long form content. I feel that this is the best, especially if you want more views on your long form content. So just take that into consideration. I know, you know, everybody's doing YouTube shorts and this is just a very strategic way to increase your views and possibly to increase your revenue quickly, okay? So hopefully you guys learned something from this video. If you did, then leave a comment down below and tell me if you're going to be using the remix feature that YouTube has given us. If you enjoyed your time on this video, go ahead and smash the like on the video. And if you want even more tips and tricks on how to grow on YouTube or to expand your brand or put money in your pockets online, then make sure to hit the subscribe button and ring that bell. With everyone doing short form content, you might want to check out this video next where I explain how to create and also export short form content or YouTube shorts using Premiere Pro. So check that out and I'm sure you'll learn a lot from this video right here on this end card screen.